Le jour de Pentecost, il prie pour vous avec toute sa force. I don't know the power that pursues here. It is only you and God that knows it. The power that follows you here tonight. Oh yeah, my power to perish. In the name of Jesus. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Disappear in the name of Jesus. Disappear in the name of Jesus. Disappear in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Overcome us, amen. Amen. Do you know when you came here? As you are here tonight, some people too they are in their meeting. They are in their coven. I told you of when we were sitting in the village around early 2000. We were still, we were still very young then. That man. Right out one day. Before we went to bed last night, the pot of my mother was empty. Nothing, no soup inside the pot. But I don't know how come meat and uh, 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 soup or uh, was found in the pot. Bush meat. Bush meat. There was nothing like soup and meat in the pot last night. Because I shouted. 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 I but say it is the blood of your children that is sweet. So I want to collect the blood of your husband. But shame for Tom, Tom Shami, Tom for Tom Shami. Now you are saying, Amen. Why you are Tom Tewari? I command God to press them down. That's strong man that said he's angry see you. He said he's always angry see you. I just hate him. That powerful man. But she shall meet on the camera. She shall meet on the camera. We are going up and down. I need all the words and worry. I said the power shall knock them down. In the name of Jesus. Lord Jesus. Do when he gets it on my rubber. You for certain person that can pray very well. So for you all. You tell God. Or I hear a lot of people want to. The issue of your life, the covenant of witchcraft. Yes, oro ayere. The issue of your life, oro ebire. The issue of your family, oro ibeyaware. The issue of your marriage, lori pepe wanje. The covenant of the witchcraft. Si wan pete pero la di she da da da. They are really ready to judge. Check in all we are going to shake it. Caught you waka. Consume them. Oh yeah, party world rule. The prayer is prophetic. And do I want to call the issue of your life on the altar of witchcraft? I the issue of your family on the altar of witchcraft. Again, they are ready to sentence judgment. What the first say? That go for you. Take it all. We go today. Let all go fire. Go to work. Consume them. Ah, 
Kanda Kapara Galada Bashenda. Somebody is not praying that prayer very well. Maybe he thought we are here to pray. We are to pray. In Jesus' name, we pray. Thank God for the kind of pastor we have here. Just thank God for the grace of God upon his life. Yeah, many of us, we didn't know all this thing when we were when, some years back. God has used this ministry to enlighten us to reality of life. What They will be doing you. Still here, yeah, they will be begging you, begging you. Short friend, fire of God will consume them. I love to address them, the parents anytime I minister. I want to beg you in the name of God anywhere your children are. Make sure you are praying for them every day. Thank God man was in his, in his final years. Coco sign out, Loku. It's just for him to sign out. The final exam, final year. He has finished his exam, final year. Oh, not serious. It was his dead body they saw. Man, I shall not be among the body. I confess all the mothers here. The Lord fed your mother, rock on him like that. That person that want to donate your child. Of the, oh, Lord, the Lord has established this mountain. Oh, don't worry. He shall march them to death. Psalm chapter 2, verse 9. I want a fast reader. I don't want to read from here. Psalm chapter 2, verse 9. I tell Yoruba version on English version. Anybody who has seen it, Psalm chapter 2, verse 9. If you find yourself in overcomers, know you are here for serious business. Anybody, Psalm chapter 2, verse 9. Let, let me hear that sonorous voice. Can you go? Thou shall break them like the rod of iron. Yes. Thou shall dash them into pieces. Like a potter's vessel. That is what the Lord will do to the wicked in your house. Now, look for the, for the, for the, for the, for the third person now. Why in the Before you now stand alone. So follow God. Now this time around, hold the person. Hold the person. Who is the wicked man, the bad man that have joined the hands together? The God of this family. I love you, Who are those people that have joined hands together? The God of this woman. The of a comma. The God of this woman. Psalm chapter two verse nine. Psalm chapter two verse nine. All of your fiery fire, all of you to have all of us to destroy your fiery fire, destroy them. All your fiery fire, all of your fiery fire, to destroy them. Break them with the rod of iron. Look, Pashanda Kapara Gadosha, Masema Nakora Mashanda Ka. I want water for us to open the door of the Lord. Lord, we are coming. I want water for us to open the door of the Lord. Lord, we are delaying the coming of the Lord. The issue of my family. Era mashali anaka, pali ana mashande kata. Let fire come down, consume them. Take it, no shaka le wako doa. Shaka tapara kapo shanda. Rima sali anakopa, jekatari akapa shande ya. Let fire come down and consume them. You know so call it. I go do it. Jesus, holy water. In Jesus' name, my Lord. A louder, Amen. Amen. Tony, le. A louder, Amen. Amen. Okay. 
That strong man that is afflicting the members of Overcome. Oh Lord, in your show, go lower. I wear the diminutive uniform. But the day the holy one move, and I hold the sword of the Lord. Most sick man like Barano, and I kill the strong man. Ati bobo unjagbara. All his weapons. Oh yeah, body what do I? Oh yeah, pray. Body what do I? Body what do I? Open your mouth and pray. My trust to do God. Don't get tired. I like but I don't want me to do. That strong man that is afflicting my life. Don't pray. That is afflicting my family. Don't come on, let you overcome my Lord. That is afflicting the members of Overcomer. My Lord, you are going to go in the name of the Lord. Mati Kaulua, I go with the sword of the Lord. Atia Lakbara, with the strong man. Atia Kbara, God is power. Atama Gure, with his strength. Mokpa Wamuta, I begin to kill them. Mokpa Wamuta, I destroy them. Let there be a flow of blood. Shake it, John Masson. Let the blood flow. Let the blood flow. In the name of Jesus. We are going to Jesus. Pack up a shanda katara. Pray very well. Pray very well. Don't do that, Dad. The power that is afflicting my family. I go with the sword of the Lord. 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 I go with the sword Pray like a militant. Badura, gaga bologo. 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 Pray, 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 pray. Badura, 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 pray, badura. Pray like a militant. Badura, bologo. God is listening to you. Allah rongo. God is listening to you. Allah rongo ti bo. Talonda oduro. Who is not party that has stopped you? Talonda ebi reduro. Stop the family. Morita, your war, eh? With your hand, with the sword in your hand. Oh yeah, Loita, you come to power. Raise that hand, that sword, and destroy them. In the them. name of Jesus. You are called Jesus. In the name of Jesus. You are called Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. You are called Jesus. Thank God, Dura. Lord, Amen. Ah, mi tori le. Bi oluwa tin beti mi embe. As the Lord lives and the Spirit lives. Oba to she that the Pharaoh. The Lord has judged Pharaoh. And he took the arrow and got the bow and one ruler. He that lifts himself above heaven. Allah bara don't pray me, the Lord you. That strong man that is afflicting you. Allah bara don't pray show the Lord you. That strong man that is afflicting the job of your hand. Don't pray me, the Lord you. That is afflicting your family. Don't you ever share no share in there no. That is troubling this ministry. Allah don't judge us in the giga. The Lord that sits in heaven must so be paid all the worry. I said it shall march them to death. Who says you will not go for the night? Who says in his hand there is power? Who says he has the final say? Over your life and family. Over this ministry. Let God arise and judge them. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you because you have answered. As your people are clapping to celebrate you. Why they sit down? In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray.
Oh, no, it's presents at our cast. 
Father, give me the grace to honor you. Shall we rise up on our feet? Shall we rise up on our feet? We want to commit ourselves into the hands of Jesus before the message tonight. And I want you to pray this prayer before the servant of God will come and give us the word of life. Use this prayer to prepare your soul. Use this prayer to prepare the ground for God's visitation tonight. And I'm believing God that is going to do wonders in our life tonight in Jesus' name. God will do wonder in our life tonight in Jesus' name. You want to pray this prayer and talk to Jesus. Lord, I have come before you tonight. Do something new in my life. Lord, do something new in my life. Lord, do something new in my life tonight. Open your mouth. Lord, do something new in my life. 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 do Surely my Lord, I can see though they have come for God's visitation. They are praying very well. Lord Jesus, do something in my life. 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 In my life, 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 in my life,
mighty name we have prayed. You will pray and talk to God. Every stone that is blocking God's visitation in my life. Be shattered to pieces. Every stone that is blocking God's visitation in my life. By the power of resurrection. Blocking God's visitation in my life. Run away by the power of resurrection. Shut out of pieces. Shut out of pieces. And when the power of visitation arrives at the grave of Jesus, the Bible makes us to understand. That the stone was rolled away. The stone was rolled away. And Jesus rose from the dead. Let every stone of darkness break God's visitation in my life. You rolled away by the power of resurrection. And Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Let me take you back. Somebody open your mouth and pray in the spirit. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. If you are happy, to see the first Tuesday, Latiri Tuesday, Akoko, of this month, shout a louder Hallelujah! Okay, hallelujah, Allah. Are you sure you are happy? Show Dalu to Penu and Are you sure you are happy? Show Dalu to Penu and If you know you are happy, Bama Penu and Go and tell three people. Lo buy new meta. Happy new month. Be a cool shoot Happy new month. A cool shoot it Happy new month. A cool shoot it Let us begin to wave our hands. Eka be si jo a si olorun. It deserves to be worshipped. Oh yeah, fun jo si wa. It deserves to be adored. Oh yeah, fun bi bi gawa. It deserves to be magnified. Oh yeah, peki abo la fun. God is awesome. Olorun je leru ni. God is powerful. O je alagbara. God is glorious. O je ologo didan. You are glorious. So glorious in your way. You are glorious. So glorious. Glorious in your 
this one prayer. Make sure you pray this prayer with all your voice. You will shout. Power to move forward in this month. Can you shout it loud again? Let your voice be louder. Possess my life. Open your mouth and pray. pray, pray, pray. The power to move forward. In this month. Possess my life. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Power to move forward. In this month. Possess my life. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. I decree by the authority of God that this new month shall be a glorious month for us. I speak by the authority of God. All manner of hindrances antagonist to opportunity is hereby taken away in the name of Jesus. The Lord will make a way for you in the mighty name of Jesus. May mighty incredible surprise abundance provision for you and your family yesterday sorrow forgotten in the name of Jesus Father we bless you we pray that this word of God we want to hear will be a blessing to our life blessing to our soul blessing to our family in the name of Jesus thank you Lord because I've done it blessed be your name Lord in Jesus mighty name we are praying if you believe that, shout a louder Amen. God bless you. You may please be seated. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tell the person beside you. You see this month, you will see next month. We have a very, very, very uh, interesting subjects to deal with tonight before we pray. We want to talk about the reward of honoring God. The reward of honoring God. What are we talking about? Somebody is not talking there. The reward of honoring God. I want us to look at a man in the, in the bible this man is going to be our main case of study then i'm going to tell us how we can honor god 
consequences of those who refuse to honor God. And the reward of those that honor God. So I want you to list him very well. Let's open our Bible to the book of 1 Samuel. Chapter 2, verse 30. Ori keji ese ogbon. First Samuel two verse thirty. We Samueli ori kini ese ogbon. Wherefore the Lord God of Israel say, I said indeed that thy house and the house of thy father should walk before me forever but now the Lord say be it far from me for them that honor me I will honor and they that despise me shall be lightly esteemed we Samuel Kini Ori Keji Esther Mobi Pe Ni Tori Na Olu Alonu Israel Wi Pe Emiti Wi Ni To Ota Pe Ile Re Ati Ile Baba Re Yo Mani Ni Wa Jumi Titi Shimbon Ni Ti Sinyi Olu Awi Pe Ki Amari I Want To Bola Fun Mi Ni Emi O Bola Fun Ati I Want To Ko Kami Si Ni Aou Si She Alai Kasi Please I Want Us To Listen Carefully Ve Ki Agbomi Dada the subject of honor is a very serious subject. Failure to understand this is the reason why a lot of people miss out in a place of encounter. Honor is a topic that we find discussed throughout the entire Bible. Both the Old Testament saints and the New Testament saints practice honor. And those that Practice it. I want to see so enjoy the blessing of honor. And those that work against it, I want to Of course, they receive the consequences of this honor. Honoring God means showing your respect. Fifi or wafun reference. Fifi or wafun and obedience to His will. Ati bolon si fere. Hallelujah. Eki Hallelujah. To honor God, lati bola folorun is to respect and show reference to God. Oje ke atuba kasi fi or wafun. And one of the way of showing. Respect to God. Lara wono tafin fi owo fun Olorun. It is by obeying his will. Ohun ni pe ki a ma gboran si ife re. Hallelujah. Eki hallelujah. I pray for us in the name of Jesus. Mo gbara fun aloruko Jesus. That pe the Lord will open our eyes. Oluwa yo si wa loju. Allah can also means living a life big day, big day, that reflect God's value of love that reflect the kindness of God that reflect the justice of God and I reflect compassion towards others. When we look at the text before us, we saw the case of a man called Eli. That 
that dishonored God. They refused to heal to God's instruction and caution. And because of that dishonor, the Lord renounced his promise and covenant for him and his generation. Today, message is a warning to every one of us never to tread the path of this honoring God for any reason because by so doing we becomes the enemy of God I pray in the name of Jesus that will not be your portion. Somebody is not saying amen. They ask us to sing before we, we don't want to sing to God. <laughs> Do you know that the Praising God is part of honoring God. To show gratitude. To show gratitude. Being grateful. Not because you have money. Or because you ate. That you are alive. It's enough reason to praise God. That you are alive. That you can shout. That you are alive. That you can walk. With your two legs. Is enough. To praise God. If you are grateful, to to more, shout a louder hallelujah. Yeah, hallelujah. Long okay. The moment a man begins to try the path of this honoring God, the Bible makes us to understand that it is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living God. If a man offend another person that is stronger than himself, he can ask God to help him to solve the problem. But what happened when a man offend God who will plead for him? When God becomes your enemy, who will deliver you from his hand? If God be for us, who can be against us? Or if God is against us, who can deliver us from his hand? In our test today, we saw God's judgment pronounced upon the house of Eli. Though God had promised him, God had promised to give his house the office of the prophets in all generations, the office of the priest in all generations. But now God is saying, Be it far from me. I am revoking my promise. Eli did not only lose God's covenant blessing, but his dishonor to God brought divine judgment of God upon his house. That was a consequence of dishonoring God. I honor his children more than God. And that ruined him. Ruined the covenant of God upon his life. Another person was raised to take his place. This honoring God attract a very deadly consequences. And that is why the Lord is speaking to each and every one of us today. 
by all means we must flee from the path of dishonoring God because no man is indispensable in the hands of God the condition to remain relevant to, re, to remain relevant in the hands of God to remain important in the hands of God is to honor him he said them that honor me I will honor so to remain relevant in the hands of God we must honor him as long as you continue to honor God he will in turn honor you yes he will shower you with honor when you honor him he will honor you if you dishonor him he will dishonor you I pray in the mighty name of Jesus Lord will release into our life the grace and the power to honor God in the mighty name of Jesus when a man is dishonoring God it means such a person is esteeming himself yes and no matter how high you may be placed in life you must honor God to stay at the top it is honoring God that retain you at the top Eli lost everything including the children because he honored them above God it is dangerous to go down the path of dishonoring God. Because you won't be able to bear the consequences. The, the promise of God is conditional. If you want God to be faithful to what He has promised you, then you must keep honoring Him. Say, I will honor God. Say it again. Somebody is not talking. Example of those that honor God. Number one is Abraham. Abraham is called the friend of God. He honor God by obeying his commandments. Hallelujah. He honor God. God his life. He had the voice of God. Go on to a land I will show you. There was no argument. He obeyed God. God told him, the only son you have, the one you love, go and sacrifice him. He said, yes, he did it. There was no argument. Today, we call him the father of faith. Why? Because he honor God. Say, I will honor God. Say it again. Second person is Moses. Moses. That's written in the book of Exodus chapter 3 verse 11. Exodus Moses honor God. By accepting the call of God upon his life to lead the Israelite out of the slavery in Egypt. In Exodus chapter 6 verse 5. The Lord said to Moses. I have heard the groaning of the people of Israel. remember my covenant Moses was the one that God sent he honored that call hallelujah 
When Moses died, God had to hide his body. Because of how important he was to the nation of Israel. Because they can immortalize him. Sure, you get what I mean by that? Because he was very anointed and powerful. The third person is David. David is known as a man after God's own heart. David He honored God by being a faithful king who loved and worshipped God amidst trials and failure. Despite failures and trials, yet he kept on worshipping God. You see what happened to him in 1 Samuel 30 verse 6. 1 Samuel 30 verse 6. But David strengthened himself in in the Lord his God. Hallelujah. When you honor God, He will honor you. And everything he lost, he got it back. Yes. Benny. But let's look at the examples of of people that dishonor God and their consequences. The first person is King Saul. You can see his case in 1 Samuel 15 verse 26. 1 Samuel 15 verse 26. He disobeyed God's command and speared King Agag and the best of the Amalekite possessions instead of destroying them all according to God's instruction. And because of that, he was rejected by God. The throne and the kingdom was taken away from him. And was given to another, another person because he dishonored God. The second person is Samson. Samson. Samson was blessed by God Samson in Gidi. with incredible strength. But he dishonored God by, by breaking his Nazareth vow and getting involved with women that worship false gods. And that led to his capture. Torture. And that led to his death. In Judges 16 verse 19. Judges 16 verse 19. The Bible says she made him to sleep on her knees. And she called a man and, and had him shave off the seven lock of his head. Then she began to torment him. And his strength his power his anointing his grace his privilege left him because so it's it is, it is honor God three Ananias and Sapphira Ananias and Sapphira and Sapphira their case is written in the book of Acts of the Apostles. Chapter 5, verse 3 and 5. Acts of the Apostles, chapter 5, verse 3 and 5. This couple, they lie to the Holy Spirit. They dishonored the Holy Spirit by telling lies. Because of that, 
the judgment of God came on them. Number four, Herod. Herod. King Herod Agrippa was a very powerful ruler. Oh, by Herod Agrippa, Ojaba Tony Agbara Gidi. Who persecuted the Christians seriously? He took more Christians in Loju Gidi Gidi. But he was struck down and killed by an angel of the Lord. Shimbange Loluwa Lokparu. Because he did not give glory to God. Today we go for you go for Lord. We can see his story in the book of Acts of the Apostles. Alleri itone ninuwe ishe apostoli. Chapter twelve, verse twenty-one to twenty-three. Ori keji la se kandini ese kini di ese kani dini obo. Acts of the Apostles, chapter twelve, twenty-one to twenty-three. Ishe apostoli ori keji la ese kani la ese kini re. This man on a particular day. Ogbe ni ni ojo tan wi yi. He put on his royal robes. Owa gbada igunare. And he sit upon the throne. And people begin to praise him. This is the voice of the God. This is the voice of the God. And not, not of a man. And immediately, the angel of the Lord struck him down. Number five. Judas Iscariot. Judas Iscariot. Judas Iscariot. Judas Iscariot. He dishonored Jesus. By selling him for thirty pieces of silver, which led to the crucifixion and the arrest of Christ. His end was very bad. He killed himself, and is now lamenting in hell. Number six, in the Kora. 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 We can see their story in Numbers 16, 27 and 32. Number 16. 27 and 32. Korah was a Levite. Kora Ojamolefi. That rebelled against Moses and Aaron. Don't you see Moses at the ceremony? And that led to his destruction. Hey, did you see Parunre? Along with his followers. Ati, I want to tell you. The Bible makes us to understand. Did you hear what we say? That Kora, that time, and and Abiram. The Kora, that time, and Abiram. The earth opened her mouth. He let lie in her. And swallow them up with their household and all the people that belongs to Kora and all their goods were swallowed by the earth because they dishonor God. Number seven is Jezebel. Jezebel Jezebel was a notorious woman. Jezebel worshippers of idol. Who was the king of Ahab? That, that led the people of Israel to worship false gods and idols. She dishonored God. Fought Elijah. Elijah. That woman was very powerful. Because she was very trickish. She operated like a witchcraft. <laughs> Hallelujah. But her end was very terrible. Jehu was anointed for the destruction of that woman. Jehu, Afroonyo, Jehu, fi banu arabi. So that she can take vengeance on her for all that dishonor she has done to God. Be kuba legba esong kumburu kuto dishinwa juolua. On that day, ni ojoi. When she heard, ni batobo that Jehu was coming. Be Jehu umbawa. Jehu was around. Jehu anito si. You know what she did? E makato she. She went and make up. Owa lokun ojure. She was a first makeup artist in the Bible. She went and began to paint her face so that she can look seductively to, to Jehu. So that she can seduce the man. But unfortunately, when God decides to punish those who dishonor him, 
Human trick and wisdom can never save that person from the hands of God. She looked from the window and saw that Jehu was coming. Oh, la to do ferese Jehu mbowa. And she quickly take her makeup and started to paint her face. Lo ba be si ni koju re lo pe te re. And one of the servants of the Jehu saw her. Lara won ran se Jehu ri. And Jehu gave instruction. Jehu si pa se. That they should throw her from the window. Won de ju la to do ferese which I believe was an upstairs. E ti mba gbo pe o je ile petesi because According to the scripture, in Second King chapter nine, verse thirty, thirty-three, and thirty-six. Second King chapter nine, verse thirty, thirty-three, and thirty-six. She was thrown out of the window, and her blood sprinkled on the wall and on the horses the horses trod on her trod her on that foot that her skull break her, her body pieces and the word of the law from the mouth of Elijah that the flesh of Jezebel shall be eaten by dog came to pass. It is dangerous to dishonor God. How can we honor God? How can we honor God? Number one, Ikini. by obeying his command. The Bible says in John chapter 14, verse 15. If you love me, keep my commandment. Hallelujah. If you love me, be a himba fair on me. Keep my commandments. A power of me more. So obeying God, be born of see your Lord. Keeping his command, be by share a more. Is honoring him. Oh, and to my pay, I'm born of him. Number two, the kitchen. Praising and worshiping him. He just seen a tiki calling see. Doing what? She shaking you. Eh? She shaking you. How many of us praise God before? Eh, me lo le man yon lor. How many of God praise God during the praise and worship? Ning bata an calling you. Tell you, me lo le yon lor. Can I see your hand? Give me the rubber in looking. If you praise God, shout hallelujah. Tell by yon lor eke hallelujah. If you sit down during the praise and worship, shout hallelujah. If you do not clap, shout hallelujah. You see? When we praise God and worship Him, we are honoring Him. The Bible says in Psalm 150, verse 6. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Even the trees praise God. The animals praise God. If you are made in the image of God, shout hallelujah. So when we praise Him and worship Him, we are honoring Him. Number three, serving others. Sixteen and one toku. Serving others. Sixteen and one toku. What does that mean? 
In Matthew 25, verse 40. Matthew 25, verse 40. Matthew 25, verse 40. Matthew 25, verse 40. The Bible says, Truly I say to you, as you did it to one of this least of this, my brother, you Ni did it to me. Ni Serving others. It's a way of honoring God. Four. Giving back to him. Giving what? Giving back to him. Proverbs chapter 3 verse 9. The Bible says, Honor the Lord with your wealth and with your first fruits of, of all your produce. Give him back to him. He bless you, you give back to him. You give back to him with offerings. You are honoring God. By doing so, you give back to him by giving your tithes. You give back to him by supporting his ministry. You give back to him by supporting his church. You give back to him by helping the helpless. Hallelujah! Give back to him. Number five. Spread speaking truth and spreading the gospel. When you speak the truth and you spread the gospel, you are honoring God. When you do what? To eh? Tubashekini. I cannot hear you. Please look up. When you do what? Yes, when you speak the truth, you honor God. When you spread the gospel, you honor God. Mark 16, verse 15. So you go into all the world and preach the gospel to every creation. Number six, supporting his servants. Supporting his servant. When you support God's servant in your local church, when you support those who are genuine servants of God, you are honoring God. You cannot be a member of this ministry and still be dishonoring your pastor in your church. Then you are not a genuine member of this ministry. Because several times we have been taught to honor those who are our pastors. There are several ways. To support God's servant, let me just give you a few of them. Number one is prayer. That's the most, one of the most important things we can do to support God's servant. It is to pray for them regularly, asking God to bless them and guide and protect them. Hallelujah. Every true servant of God around your life, they are a gift from God to you. They are what? Number two is encouragement. That's another way to support God's servant. Offer them. Words of encouragement and an affirmation. One of what? Encouragement or an affirmation. Letting them to know that their work, their efforts. Is appreciated and valued. See what I'm talking about. Eh? You have been in a church. 
Bi wa ni le josin re. The past two years. Oh, three years. Odo meje du meta. You have never encouraged your pastor. Oh, fi gba kon mu iranse Olorun re lokan le ri. Ha. God will forgive you. You are not saying amen. I know you will not say amen now. Okay, ni shami. God will forgive you. Olorun yo dariji yo. Encourage. I oro igba ni niyanju. Encourage them. Oro imu lokan le. Number 3. Iketa. You can support them financially. E le ti won leyin nipa iran lowo owo. There are many servants of God who are into free time calling. Oh, won ranse lorun mi won te pe igbe won ko gba won lai lati ma se se ara. It is you. Iwo that God will use. Ni Oluwa Yolo. It is I. Amen. That God will use. Oluwa Yolo to care for them. Lati ma na ni won. Hallelujah. Eyi Oluwa. So offering them financial support. Kamati won leyin nipa iran lowo owo. Can be a practical way of helping them to continue to serve effectively. O je ona ti a le fi ran won lowo lati ma fi yan lati ma fi sise fo Oluwa takutako. Ikeni we can support support them practically. We can support them practically. Ale mati won leyin nipa igbegbese by giving helping hand. Nipa sise iran lowo Things are not going well. Things uh, are not working well. I want to go to the other place. I have the capacity to put it in order. What they need, ba, let it share, let it let it. You give the helping hand. Wa she no no wa jai de. Make yourself available. Wa je ko wa ne ra wato. Hallelujah. Enyo luwa. You volunteer to help. Wa yonder ra let it share no wa. To partners. Lati ma she. And to assist with their administrative needs. So what is a reward? Of honoring God. When we honor God, what is going to be our reward? Number one is blessing. What is number one? If you will receive that blessing, shout it very loud. Your voice is not loud very well. When we honor God, number one reward is blessing. Blessing. The Bible makes us to understand in Proverbs 3, verse 9 to 10. That when we honor God with our wealth and, and our first fruits, say your barn will be filled with plenty, and your vat will be bursting with wine. Blessing. Number two, honoring God. One of the reward is. Those that honor God, they always have privilege of guidance. Guidance in their life choices. Direction for their path. Uh, God said, because you honor me with your life, I will guide you. The Lord will guide me. I hear you sleeping. I said, The Lord will guide me. The Lord will guide me. Say it louder. The Bible says in Proverbs. Chapter 3, verse 5 to 6. Says, Trust the Lord with all your heart and do not lean upon your understanding. In all your way, acknowledge Him and He will make your path stretch. Yes. Number three forgiveness. God's mercy and forgiveness are available for all that honor him. Oh, wow. You say because he honor me. You know that that happened to Ahab 
when they have kidnapped and took his vineyard and the prophet of God came to announce that judgment of God was coming upon them Ahab cried in repentance before the prophet of God got home he was instructed to go back to the same Ahab very notorious king said, because you honor me and you grieve for what you have done what I say I will do to you I will not do it again but eventually the man still went back he went back to his wickedness that was the reason why he died a very terrible death so, forgiveness of sin son of the reward number four freedom from fear freedom from fear honoring God brings sense of peace and freedom yes. as in you, you will feel you know that no I am honoring God with my life God will not let me down See, have you ever faced any challenges the only thing that was just giving you confidence is that I know that I honor God with my life and I know he will fight for me have you expressed such a thing before yes, I am talking from experience freedom from fear just have courage and boldness because you know because you honor God this honor shall not be my portion oh. Psalm 4 verse 8 in peace I will lie down and sleep for you are alone. You are my, you are my, you are my safety. He won't be sad me. Hallelujah. Number five. Prosperity. Oro. Prosperity. Oro. Those that honor God with their wealth will be blessed with prosperity. I want you want bola for the pelu oro won ni won yo serere prosperity won serere the work of my hands shall be blessed how book you fin she won me the work of your hands shall be blessed how book you fin she won pelu when you honor god in gbadoba bola for lord number 6 ikefa is protection oni abo what did i say kini mo bi o say it louder e so lo won oke louder lo won oke protection abo god promised to protect and deliver those who honor him. Psalm 91, verse 15. He will call upon me. And I will answer him. That is me. I will be with him in trouble. I will rescue him and honor him I think we need to personalize it he will be with me in trouble he will rescue me and honor me that's the promise if you honor God that is for you say that is for me say it again say it again number seven wisdom wisdom i am praying for you the lord will bless you with wisdom that will confuse your enemy Honoring God leads to a deeper understanding and wisdom. The Bible says in Psalm 1 verse 10, 
The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. All those who practice it have a good understanding. When you honor God, He will bless you with wisdom that will be a mystery to the enemy. Wisdom to break through in the midst of competition wisdom to overcome when the enemy thought is over for you wisdom to skip through when it seems the business will not rise again wisdom hallelujah somebody is not shouting hallelujah is that hallelujah of the mouth of me? She hallelujah of the canoni. Number what now? Eh? O kaola of a cobay. Number what? O kake jo. Are you sure? Should I load you? Number eight. Ike jo. Hidden secrets. I want Shiri Koko. Will be revealed to you. Now of the home. Hidden what? I should kin you. Why people are those people who are enjoying themselves in Sodom? The Lord was revealing to Abraham. Abraham. I will soon break it down. And they did not know that destruction was coming. When you honor God, there are some, some certain things God will say no. I must show my son, I must show my daughter, and this thing should not just have, she must be aware, he must be aware about it. Psalm 25 verse 14. Psalm 25 verse 14. The secret of the Lord is with those who fear him. The secret of what? Of who? Is with who? Those that fear him. Those that fear him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Lord told Abraham, He said, Can I can I hide something from Abraham, my friend? Oh my God. He honor go to that to that level. When God say, I need to tell him before I do something. Can I hide? Ah. May the Lord give us the power to honor Him. Somebody is not saying Amen. Number nine. Health. Ilira. Health. Ilira. When we honor God, it brings physical and spiritual healing. In fact, the Bible says in Jeremiah chapter 30, verse 17. Said, I will restore you to health and heal your wound. When we honor God, it brings healings. Both physical and spiritually. There are several cases of people who honor God. And in return, God decided to take away their sickness. Now look at the case of Lazarus. That died. For this. For the many. Now imagine his case. When the Lord God before his tomb, he wept. And people say, ah, he loved him. If you look at that family, their relationship, their relationship with Jesus. Christ to Christ, Christ used to go there just to rest. They cook for him. They feed him. They talk together. They honor him. And this is why death could not hold Lazarus down. Even when he was thinking. 
speaking Jesus said it is not yet time for you to die there are some things that will never happen to you even when it happened it won't take away your life and the only thing that will be crying out is because you honor God and that's the reason why when they say he's, he's thinking Christ said he's not dead say I am not dead say it again I am alive and I shall live hallelujah and he that was dead came back to life so when we honor God it brings physical and spiritual healing and lastly number 10 when we honor God there is a heavenly reward a heavenly reward those that honor God they will have eternal life in the kingdom of God that's why the Bible says in Colossians chapter 3 23 to 24 Colossians 3 open your Bible to that place we want to read that place together Colossians 3 verse 23 to 24 please stand up on your feet and carry your bible let's read it together Colossians chapter 3 verse, verse 23 to 24 uh, please I would like us to read to 25 are you there? alright let's read it one to go and whatsoever you do do it heartily as to the Lord and not unto men knowing that of the Lord you shall receive the reward of the inheritance for you serve the Lord Christ for he that doeth wrong shall receive for the wrong which you are done and there is no respect close your eyes for prayer father in any area i have been dishonoring you please forgive me open your mouth and pray that prayer that's a serious prayer in any area i have been dishonoring you is somebody praying at all? Please forgive me. Have mercy on me, Jesus. Have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. Jesus, have mercy on me. According to your grace, according to your grace, according to your grace, according to your grace. According to the multitude of your loving kindness, have mercy on me. According to your grace, oh, according to your grace, according to your grace. Hey, hey.
According to the merciful calling kindness, have mercy on me. Father, in any area of dishonor, you please forgive me. Please open your mouth and pray that prayer. In any area I have dishonored you, please, Lord, forgive me. Please forgive me. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Show me mercy, Lord. Show me mercy. In any area I have been dishonoring you. Please show me mercy. Show me for me. Show me mercy, Lord. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Ma popo sonda ye kasi maya sanya ya pa. According to your grace, oh Lord, according to your grace, according to your grace, oh Lord, according to your grace. According to the multitude of your loving kindness, of mercy on me. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Lord God, Jesus, I adore. Can we come forward? I want us to pray. Don't turn like a rock. Don't turn like a rock. Don't turn like a rock. Don't allow me, Jesus, to go empty and dead. Don't allow me. Clap your hands very well. Don't allow me. Don't allow me, Jesus, to go empty and dead. Don't allow me. Don't allow me. Don't allow me, Jesus. To go empty-handed. Don't allow me. Don't allow me. Don't allow me. Don't allow me. I want you to sing that song passionately. Don't allow me. Hey. Don't allow me. Don't allow me, Don't allow me Jesus. To go empty-handed.
I want us to pray this prayer seriously. Joshua the high priest was in the presence of God. But he was wearing a strange garment. And Satan stood with him to resist him. Satanity odroti lati denaduare. You will shout every strange garment of dishonor. Please, I want us to pray very well. Every strange garment of dishonor that is making the devil to attack my prayer. Cast fire. Every strange garment of this honor. Yes. Somebody is not praying up prayer. Strange garment of this hollow that is giving the audacity to Satan to, to attack my prayer. Cast fire. Aha. Somebody pray that prayer. He said, Pity that woman in the prayer is not praying. Pray. 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 The damage of this honor that I am wearing that is making Satan to resist my prayer. Scared fire. Yes, 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 yes. Pina, 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 Pina. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, God, this is like that. Somebody is not praying that prayer yet very well. Joshua didn't know that Joshua that Satan was resisting him. Please, I want you to pray. You will shout. Every food he got. That is fighting my prayer. Can you shout it loud and clear? Cash fire! Oh, Open your mouth and pray the prayer. Yes. Feel the damage in my life. Feel the damage in my life. Feel the damage in my life. Opposing my prayer. That is opposing my prayer. Cat fat, 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 cat uh -huh. please add more fire. Add more fire. It is working. It is working. Oh, she shall. She shall. It's working. It's working. Oh, she shall. It's working. It's working. Catch fire. Okay. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord God, they should like Badua. So my prayers on the message. Badua made this glory wash. This this first one is very important. Akoko you should partake. Only those I want to make heaven should pray. I want to buy the door in the Kuba. You will shout. Wakaru. Oh Lord, my Father. 
That is this honoring you. I command you to die. Aha. Anything in my life happened to me. That is this honoring you. Yes. 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 In Jesus' name, we are praying. Lord God, just like that. Now, this last one. I do have to It's very, it's very important. Please make sure you pray it very well. You will shout. Anything in my life that is strengthening my attacker. Can you shout it loud and clear? Oh, oh, I don't like the way you are shouting. Anything in my life. That is strengthening my attacker. I want to share. Call you see me like that. Open your mouth up, brother. Yes, 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 yes. Anything in my life that is strengthening my attacker. Die by fire. 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 Me, Oruka, Jesus, Christian, Agbadura. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Amen. This week, me also. We just also to me Agbara. It's a powerful week, and I pray that we will not miss. Oh, Jesus, God, I pray I will not pass that note. Go, go, I want to. On why you want to daru? Everyone that the journey of their life is scattered. Me, no, I say in this week. There will be remedies. There's going to be a solution. And that's the reason why I want to beg you. Don't miss this session now. And don't miss the Thursday and Friday program because that's going to be the one is it. That's Friday. This prayer, please. I do are you. If you are feeling sleepy, go and sleep. Because it is dangerous for you. It is dangerous for you to pray it with seriousness. I say my own. If you are feeling sleepy, go and sleep. Don't worry. We will cover you with the blood of Jesus. <laughs> yes. Uh, we will cover you, don't worry. But for those who are ready to pray, please pray. Don't pray a, a fine boy prayer. Pray in a radical way. Wherever you are washing from, any part of the world, make sure you take this session of prayer very serious. We want to start. We want to start from our childhood. Are you ready to pray? Are you ready to pray? So I will say it in Yoruba. I can also say it in English if uh, I'm not satisfied with what my interpreter is saying. The first prayer we're going to pray. 
iji to wo ni to wo nu irin ajo mi nigbati mo wa ninu oyun any storm that entered into the journey of my life when i was in my mother's womb yes iji any storm to wo nu irin ajo aye that mi. entered into the journey of my life nigbati mo wa ninu oyun when i was in my mother's womb see let me tell you something let me so go for there are some people i want come wa eh Right from the womb, Latin no new. They have no who they are. No one to marry and touch it. If you don't believe me, to <laughs> back me, bro. Go and check the book of Revelation. Lord, that dragon was waiting, waiting for that woman to give birth. Ah, dragon did not ready to go up and go be man. to go after the child. Go let the power man up. Please pray very well. Jump back, do that, that. Oh, yeah, Jack Delaney. Come out today. Lord, we need to unite. Come out. If you don't pray, we tell you to leave this place. To Bagbadu Amalio. I want you to pray radically. I'm going to go back to what? It's just a one-way journey. I just want to enter the journey of my life. Make that team one in one. When I was in my mother's womb. Lord, we need to unite. I am Jesus. I am the Lord. In Jesus name we pray Lord God just like that do Olorun fe se atunse awon ayomo God ti ati that have been turned upside down God want to restore some destiny that have been turned upside down Somebody is here and come baby listen carefully that go at that time when you were very very small that those who are lord don't more going get green your mother yare give you to a neighbor of your phone uh uh so please i like to be looking after him be a joy my bamboo you too till i will come back teach him of your father did and that give them access to your life really you have one year funny lot to talk about you we better pray very well oh take back to that what that drug you pray Eh, chick by draw and moche fesse. You have not prayers. I want to pray. Ah, oh God, to one we shed down the Latin no on you. Battle that enter into my destiny right from the womb. Battle that enter into my destiny from the womb. Oh God, to one we shed down the Latin no on you. As I jump, we must jump for something. Oh God, we must jump for something. Oh God, we must jump for something. Oh God, we must jump for something. Yes, that aspect the, the last, last one on that aspect prayer on this aspect every battle that recreates my life when i was in my mother's womb yes 
Do you hear that prayer? Battles of manipulation that entered into my life when I was in the womb. Please pray that prayer. You thought you are drinking herbs. You thought is is herb you drink. You thought they were helping you. You didn't know. Oh my. It was to poison your destiny. And manipulate it. You were shy. Battles of manipulation. That entire my life when I was in the womb. Yes, 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 yes. Ayita, ayita. And you don't want to hear me. Battles of manipulation. Oh yeah, my life. In my mother's home. Jump out. 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 Yes. In we are we'll be taking it one by one. Our mom be the house of that strong man that my parents took me to in, in their ignorance. Yes. The house of the strong man that my parents took me to in ignorance. Father, deliver my destiny from that place today. Hey. Deliver the portion of my star. Deliver the portion of my destiny. Deliver, 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 Yes, 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 Jesus, mighty name, we are praying. Lord God, bless you like that. Ah, in the covenant that I enter. In the house of the friend of my parents. The strange covenant I enter. In the house of the friends of my parents. I come out by fire. You are not praying very well. Yes, 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 yes. I come out. 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 I 
Now the last prayer on that. The treasure I lost. In the house of the friends of my parents. The original I lost. See In the house of the friend of my parents. Father. Baba. Arise. Did they locate it? Shawarie. Back for me. Back for me. Take it back for back me. For me. Take it back for me. Back for me. Take it back for me. Back for me. Open your mouth and pray. Yes. Open your mouth and pray. Pray, 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 pray. The original I lost. The original I lost. The treasure I lost. To the house of the friends of my parents. Arise, O Lord. Take them back for me. Take them back. Take them back. Take them back. Take them back. Tell them back, tell them back, tell them back, tell them back, tell Yes. Now we want to pray about curse. Yes. What? We pray. Wherever in my life that is under the bondage of the curse of my parents, receive deliverance. A man was seeking for job. For years. For years. For years. I didn't keep rejecting. Once I call. Until Titi, he was told, Go and meet your parents. At that time, when he was small, early in the morning, we place a curse. I'm a, I'm a place a curse on him. And that's why, parent, that you don't have control over your mouth. I won't be you one I put it in. So early in the morning, Tell your parents to bless you. And renounce all those things they have said against your life. That was when he was able to get the job. If not, so he, will, he will look for a job tired. You are going to pray. Any area of my life. That is under the bondage of the curse of my parents. That the curse of my parents is monitoring. The curse of my parents is supervising. Every area of my life, every aspect of my life that is being supervised by the curse of my parents. Receive deliverance by fire. Somebody pray, 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 pray. I yes. will be Oh, yeah, in the bondage of the oh, yeah, curse yeah, yeah, of my parents, yeah, yeah, be liberated, yeah, be liberated, yeah, be liberated, yeah, be liberated, yeah, be delivered by fire, yeah, be delivered by fire, yeah, be delivered yeah, by, yeah, by, yeah, by, yeah, by fire, 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 by if you keep in your name, take that will be me, but you don't just step that will be me, Shakoso. A lot of today, oh, yeah, to me, sir. Oh, yeah, that's the that's the that's the never know 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 if you keep in your name, yes, that will be me, but you don't. Oh, yeah, that's the sun, the banner, that's the sun, that's the sun. In Jesus, they will pray. No, God, just like that, you are. Nick Kori Tayon Lawa at the junction of Epp. 
that the cause of my parents stand with me Lord, I rise and deliver me. Deliver me, deliver me. Lord, I rise and deliver me. Oh, ah, ah. We are too cold. Me corita rolowa. The junction of help. Me corita ano. The junction of mercy. Me corita ojurere. The junction of favor. Ati anfaniti ko wapa. Of common benefits. Enjoy. Tie ko be me to draw the iron. That the cause of my parents stand against my life. Oh Lord, the Lord arise. Deliver me. Deliver me. Pray, 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 pray. the name of Jesus, Lord, in that function of help, that function of mercy, that function of favor, that the cost of my parents, 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 that the cost Arise, deliver, 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 deliver me. me. Arise, oh Lord, deliver me, deliver me. At that yes. junction of a life, that junction of help, that junction of mercy, that junction of uncommon benefits, that junction of favor, that the cause of my parent is standing against my life. Oh Lord, arise and set me free and deliver me, 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 any strange hand or what did let's add three more we are going to meet on thursday let us see how bad in your thursday so i want us to close on time because of those who are going to their place of work on thursday we will have time to thursday, pray we have two hours to pray on thursday two hours to pray on, two hours to pray on, to pray on thursday on friday. On friday. On friday. so please make sure you pray it strange hand or what did you in my head, you really come out. Tell him, and you a bad dry. Please pray that prayer very well. A bad da da. Please pray. You will pray it radically. The alone a power strange and power in my head. You will come out. Come out. Come out. Come Yes, 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 yes. Every strange hand Lord, in my head. Tell him. In the end of my life, my children, come, 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 Banner Jati, 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 who will watch it, Lori, by no Jati, by no Jati, 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 Second prayer, I hear it in my ears. Please let us pray very well. Majem covenant. Don't die to a yemi roof. That is scattering the plans of God for my life. No. That is scattering the story of my life. Don't die to a yemi roof. Every covenant. Majem. That is scattering the story of my life. Don't die to a yemi roof. Yes. By the power of the covenant of Jesus. Majem Jesus. Every covenant that is scattering the story of my life. Yes, by the power of the covenant of Jesus. Jesus, 
the last prayer to okay. Thursday or Friday is don't visit at Friday your work my father no is a program by the leading of God but they to your lord and I know leave. that many people will leave from prison to palace. And not, not palace in the wilderness. But in your place of manifestation. The last prayer we want to pray for today. Every covenant of suffering in my blood. Covenant of suffering. In my blood. Let me tell you something. There are some people. I want Even if you give them one million. one million. Something we see take that money away. And they will go back to square one to suffer. I'm telling you. Every covenant of sovereign in my blood. Lord of Jesus. Push it out. Amen. Amen. Please be in the spirit. Don't let another person push it in your life. Covenant of suffering. In my blood. Ah, hey, hey. Blood of Jesus. Push it out. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Open your Every covenant of suffering, covenant of suffering, my in my blood, blood of Jesus, push it out, 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 push it, 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 Aha! Woma jamuiya. Ninu a jami. Covenant of suffering, my blood. Eja Jesus, blood of Jesus. Tinja de. Push it out. In Jesus, mighty name we have prayed. I decree by the authority of God. Every covenant of suffering. In your blood. Today. Receive deliverance from evil blood. By Dante. Covenant of suffering, that is frustrating your effort to prosper. Is hereby destroyed today. In this month of May, there shall be divine intervention. In every aspect of our life, in the mighty name of Jesus, in this month of May, our expectation shall not be cut short. We will not be disappointed. We will not know failure. 
who don't know disappointment favor shall decorate us help us shall locate us financially the Lord will support you your business will expand your family shall be honored in the mighty name of Jesus power that always work against opportunity in this month I command they will have no access to your life every good dream will start being fulfilled this month we we'll start fulfilling this month. I pray for that person. The trap they have set for you this month shall be consumed by fire. You will not fall into it. Oh, this any destiny destroyer associating with that your child the law will separate them in the mighty name of Jesus whatever barrier that the enemy has programmed to frustrate what you are processing that barrier the Lord has removed it right now I think I've shared this with you of a woman that her husband wanted to do his passport and uh, whenever he get to his turn there was always error or when another person come there the thing will work when they when they go there error and the thing get, and they started praying and nothing was and for for a decade and the thing was keep occurring until the wife Called me and voiced out. The machine was not working. Machine here, she share. 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 It's like something is wrong with you. And after prayer, you know, you know, you know, you know, that embargo was removed. Then then on by Monday, by Monday, I pray with her on Saturday. By Monday, I pray with her on Saturday. By Monday, I pray with her on Saturday. By Monday, I pray Everything was okay. Everything was okay. I was happy when I see her in abroad with her husband. <laughs> what God cannot do does not exist. Whatever thing the enemy has programmed to hinder what you are planning. Lati de na o to nse to to frustrate your efforts lati pon la kakare loju that program of the enemy i destroy it right now e to ta yen mo pa run bayi it is where with you o ti dara fun okan yin in this month of may ninu osikarun yi you will have reason to say, I am blessed. 
will have reason to say my business is blessed see it is not just speaking by faith you will have reason to say my family is blessed it is done thank you lord because i've done it blessed be your name lord in jesus mighty name we have prayed if you believe that shout a bigger hallelujah God bless you. you. Can go back to your seat. Let's clap for Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank God for what God has done. To Him be all glory and honor. What He has done shall be permanent in Jesus' name. Amen. Today. We want to do publicity of the special prayer and fasting that we are having on Thursday and Friday. In this surrounding, so we are expecting us to come in the evening. Let's be here in the evening by 4 30. So come the Lord will bless you in Jesus name. Say amen very well. So please Thursday and Friday there is no African time. As you know that if you say we are starting by 4 we start by 4. So please do your best to make sure as I'm giving the announcement, please, please, uh, let's take our offering. Uh, As I'm giving the announcement, please, uh, drop your offering. If you want to pay offering online, you can see details in the description. So, there is no African time. No African time. At you, Please make sure you are here on time. Make sure you are what? Here you. on time. Don't hey, start baby. coming from your house that, that by that uh, four. Hey, At least by three thirty, you should leave your house. Ah, Please, I want you to surprise me. By coming early. coming early. I hope you will do that. She, eh, oh, she. Eh? Please let us come here on time so that we can, I promise you two hours. She two she hours, it won't exceed two hours. Our cat, me, the queen, la, oh, and after the prayer, we are going to break the fasting. Nay, I draw, hmm? no. As ja, we have away. heard before, but it's a better lady that you fast according to your capacity. Take you, Agba, we be ashamed, Agbara. Eh? But the normal time is 6 p.m. that we are going to be breaking the fasting. And at the same time, 5 p.m. Uh, 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 Friday, the same thing. Back on Friday, the same thing. Back on Friday, the same thing. Friday, the same thing. Back on Friday, the same thing. Back on Friday, the same thing. the the of the of the fasting and prayer is divine intervention. Let us do our best and tell others. Invite your friends. Invite your pastors. Invite your members. Tell them to come. Come with your husband. Come with your wife. Come with your children. Come with your friends. And we will experience the power of God. There shall be divine intervention in every aspect of our life. Somebody is not saying amen. Then after the program, we are going to, we are going to plan for a career program. Career. It's going to be a very interesting program that will help you, that will 
open your knowledge, understanding to business and so many other things. Because and you will have you will ask questions. That is related to business. So there is a place of prayer. There is a place of action. She will understand. And so a lot of us we have not yet discovered destiny, discover what God wants us to do, and all those kind of things. So we are going to plan for that, but that is going to be after uh, the workers after the workers faced by the grace of God. And the Lord is going to bless you in the name of Jesus. When are we coming here? When are we coming here? Thursday and what? Are we coming here today? Eh? We are coming here for what? So please make sure you are here and the Lord will bless you. And also we printed tract for evangelism. We don't have Yoruba version. It's, it's only English we have for now. So if you need a tract, tract please, it is available you. here today. I mean now. It's available now. I mean, bye, bye. So when we have shared the grace, you can come and ask, collect your own for evangelism. And the Lord will bless you in Jesus' name. Let us stand up. We have close. Let's stand up. No African time. On Thursday. No African time on Friday. Please do your best to be here on time. And when you enter here, don't be doing talk talk. Be praying. And be talking to God. Father, in this program, let there be divine intervention in my life. And the Lord will do it in Jesus' name. Say amen to that. Let's quickly do something. You will go and tell seven people in this month, I will see you rejoicing and celebrating. Make sure there are seven. In this month, I will see you rejoicing Mario. and celebrating. I will see you rejoicing Mario. and celebrating. Rejoicing and celebrating. Rejoicing and celebrating. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let's share the grace in fellowship. The grace of the grace our Lord Jesus Christ. Christ the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Forever and ever. We want to shout seven hallelujah for seeing a new month and that this month we is going to be a good month for us. We want to shout seven hallelujah. After that seven hallelujah, we will go and tell three people don't forget to always honor God. Don't forget to always honor God. Are you ready? Seven, hallelujah! hallelujah.